this is Diocletian's palace, or what remains of it. It was built in the third, well, fourth century, third century AD. Uh, and Diocletian was one of the most successful of Rome's emperors. Uh, he built this palace, which was huge, uh, as his retirement home. And it is where he ultimately ended up and passed away. But he was the emperor that split the Roman Empire into two. And he actually rose from the ranks of soldiers and became the head of the emperor's, um, the emperor's capital. And he was chosen whenever the previous emperor died to become the emperor. So he rose from nothing to running this enormous empire. And he lived, look at this, it's amazing. That's not, that's not his palace. That was built later. But the whole, the whole city is really built on the foundation of this palace. And then it just kind of morphs into the rest of the city. And so you see these ancient other buildings and cathedrals that were built a thousand years later or 500 years later. And you end up with this kind of symbiotic architectural wonder. And it looks like right now they're going to have a changing of the guard. And the Roman soldiers are ready.